Okay, so in this episode, we are going to create the system where we use a like only one time. So if I like here, it will be two. But if I again like, it will not going to increment. It will decrement. That means a user can like a post only one time and after that we are going to finalize our like system so with that welcome back to bitfilms i'm your host sarthak this is a channel where i talk about level and the cool thing about level so if you are new to this channel don't forget to subscribe and like bitfilms on facebook twitter and instagram so let's see how we can use these things so we have restricted the user for creating any like without logged in okay so until he is logged in so we will log in to create like system but user can like a post many times so we have to restrict it so if i refresh this i will delete everything so that we will start from starting that means we don't have any like for any post next thing is that so we have to check if the user is liked the post or not okay so what we can do in the post controller whenever we are saving the like firstly i can check what the user if there is a entry in the like table with a username and the post simultaneously so we will say like check is equal to I will use like where now here comes user underscore ID is auth ID and this will always work because we are always hitting this function if we are logged in or the user logged in so it doesn't matter so that should be double head arrow okay and here comes the post underscore id and that should be request arrow that should be request arrow id and we will get the first one so now we have to check if that should be like like dollar like check have some value then we will going to delete this thing so i will get all these things from here and instead of first i will say delete so this thing is good but else we are doing all these things once more so how this works so we are checking for any like so if the user has liked the post then this will get value of one so if this have have some value then we are going to delete but the user is liking a post for the first time then this will get zero and if this gets zero it will go to else part and it will create a new entry okay so save this go back refresh and i will say one that's good so we have this entry here if I will again hit, oops, it's it still say two. Let's see in the database. Oh, in the database is actually correct, but we have some problem in the view. So let's go to view and for the posts dot view. Okay, so we have to do some kind of system that if this is deleted or if it is created. So I will say return um deleted okay so obviously that should be return return and obviously i will use this on this posts dot view so okay so response and go refresh and let's click here and you can see it's having response with the data of nothing again if i click so the second one will have data of deleted so we have to check this one so i will say firstly if response dot data is equal to deleted what i have to do then then 
to negative part that means decrement okay else increment so that should be positive okay so comment this so now go refresh and let's click yeah light and entry yeah very good let's one more time click and zero and the entry is nothing so click here click here and left that part and click here reload the page we have one click one click one click log out from here one click one click one click and log in with another id and let's see what we have okay bit fumes so bit fumes one two three four five six and go back one click one click and one click let's click again yeah this is a new user and clicking and liking yeah very nice so click one more time one two and one so likes are here so one last thing i need is if it is clicked or it has some like it has to be red colored okay not that black and if it is having zero likes then i will show that as a simple black colored like okay so let's go to post dot view and here you can see we have this thing so i will use one thing called v if so v if that it will just like if else statement so i will say if likes dot length is less than zero or simply is equal to zero then show this one otherwise we have to say greater than zero if value is greater than zero but this time i have to say not if that should be else okay and here let's give this a uh, style of color red okay so this one is red and it will always come if likes have so okay so refresh and yeah you can see likes 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 are red but the second one which having zero it's it is still have that one so maybe if it is like less than zero maybe no it's not working so this will be if likes dot length okay let's use this like count instead of likes so like count dot length or not length this time we have to simply use value so value is equal to zero then show black color yay we have done this but if the value is greater than zero then show the red color and the next thing is if i click any of this you don't have any route because the slug is nothing so we just have to give the slug here so slug is equal to again we can use oops not these things we can use value dot slug okay so if i go refresh and click and it's not still getting that thing why is that let's see the post we have post oops we don't have any prop called slug okay so slug is here reload but again it still it will not work you know why because we have to bind this href so for binding we can say v bind is equal to uh, v bind colon or we simply say colon so colon href is equal to slug now refresh and we have this refresh oops it's sixth only so instead of this what we can say okay so here what we can do again we can open post pro, uh, post model and here once more create a function as a get slug attribute and this is you know an 
accessor so what i will do every time it will hit the slug we will get the slug as a uh, route of route of we have to open web.php and this one post and giving this original value so post model is here and here we have to say post and we will pass the slugs that is with the value okay so save this file go back refresh and hit and again it's not getting that thing okay it's called it says diff for human is not working because if i go to this post you can see we are again using diff for human and for created at but for the created at we also have this accessor which is having diff for value so we can delete that diff for value from this post so i will delete that okay reload this page and yeah we have all these new posts here so if i go to the first one and yes we have everything working very fine okay so i will just push this for github so i will say after part i think this is 35 part 35 I think that is 33, 34 and 35 and this means after like system okay so we have completed this so commit this to master sync this and we are syncing so we have to wait some time so we have completed syncing part. Let's go to GitHub repository of Bitfumes. So Bitfumes GitHub repository, github.com slash Bitfumes. Create blog with admin panel. And we have 16 commits. And the latest commit is this one, 33, 34, 35. And description is after like system. So that means if you are on a 32 part, you can grab the project at that point. If you are on a 22 part, you can grab the project from that 22 part 22nd part okay so this is for 22 part so this is very nice for github repository you will get from stage by stage whatever i am doing so all these things and let's see in the next episode what we are going to do or what we have left for from my side the series is now ending and for that i will appreciate your patience and i will thank you for watching this series for and and growing with me we will start new series very soon i think that real time chat series i will start very soon and if you have any doubt if you have any question feel free to message me i will congratulate you to complete this project and also we will complete many project with together and your support is my strength so we will meet in the next episode till then don't forget to subscribe like bitfumes on facebook twitter and instagram and you can support me on patreon.com one dollar or more you can donate if you want and bye bye